the vlog. Hey y'all, I missed y'all. So I decided to pick y'all up and my face is looking crazy. Skin is looking better. But um, my last vlog I went and got um, a facial with um, micro needling and I didn't know that she also incorporated a pill. So my skin is peeling as you guys can see. It is definitely peeling. So um, I haven't been able to put like none of the um, products that I have been using on my skin or my face uh, because it's very sensitive. Uh, but I'm excited because I'm about to go pull up on y'all boy today. I'm gonna go pull up on my dad. I'm excited because he um, he's never seen me drive my truck. He's never seen me like actually like in my truck driving like people always be like boy I seen your daughter they like tell him that they saw me but he's never saw me in my truck so um I'm getting unloaded right now which is why I'm in the back of the truck so y'all can see the front up there so I'm in the dock getting unloaded so um while they unloading me um they should be done within like the next hour I already told him that I'm gonna go down to his job and um come see him i'm excited maybe we'll probably go get lunch or something i don't know yeah maybe i'll go take him to to lunch or something we'll see what happens um but yeah i'm excited like my mom has seen me drive the truck before because when i did local on uh, the company i was with like i used to sneak sneak and go by my mom's house so i never recorded it because you just never know who's watching to go back and tell and be like oh well i saw such and such with the truck and she took a different route so i never recorded but my mom um, have seen me um, in my in my truck before uh, and that was just a good feeling too like y'all knowing where I came from coming from the club it's like wow like I really did a whole 360 a whole career change like just a whole everything so you know pat myself on the back your girl <laughs> I'm definitely um, proud of myself and it's a good feeling because so many people are like rooting for me and like they just just seeing me out here doing my thing in my element it's a good look, you know. But um, yeah, it is 12:08, December 7th, and I'm excited. And he's been asking for y'all, but they've been having him doing a lot of overtime. Like he's been working um, six days a week with his one day off. So like we haven't had a chance to link back up for y'all to see him again. And I told him that y'all been asking for him, and he was like, I miss them too. So I told him, don't worry, I'm gonna pick up the camera and I'm gonna vlog when I pull up on you. So um, we gonna get to see him today and I'm excited. Like, I don't know why, I feel like, I don't know, I'm just excited. It's just a good feeling. Uh, especially knowing like where we came from. Y'all know I talked about um, our link up, how I had to like, tell him how I felt, how we really didn't have a bond. And it's just like, that one talk turned into a whole bonding situation. like. He calls almost every day while I'm on the road. He calls and check up on me. I'm going to start recording some of our conversations because he be having me rolling and stuff. But, um, yeah, I just love the space that I'm in with him. Our bond has just been... It's something that I've always wanted that I kind of be like, should I have made the step years ago when I've been felt this way? But I'm just thankful, you know, how they say better late than never, that I did take that step and, you know, um, reached out and... Yeah, I have no regrets. Um, so yeah, I'll probably pick y'all back up once we pull up on him. All right, y'all. So I just got unloaded. I'm about to call my dad now and let him know that I'm about to pull up. Hi. Hello. I'm on my way, probably like 10 All minutes, right. 15 minutes yeah. away. Okay. Okay. All right. All right, so y'all see my trailer is empty. I'm gonna go ahead and close the doors and then we about to go pull up on Daddy. Yeah, what do you put? You make a sucker, bat me and make sure you're 
through all your shit. I'm good. It ain't that much. You just know nice, it's cool. Got all your snacks and. <laughs> yeah, yeah, my snacks on the seat. <laughs> yeah. You too funny. Got all your snacks and got all this kind of shit. Yeah, stuff I could just reach on that side. Yeah, get it. Yeah, wait. Yeah, because I'll be able to stop. Yeah, that's good right there. You sure? There go y'all boy. Yo, what's up? This your boy. I'm at work, y'all. I miss y'all. I love y'all. <laughs> I'll be back, though. Too funny, I'll be back, y'all. How y'all been doing out there? Hey, how your mama doing? Oh, yes, yeah. How your daddy doing? Yes, you don't know. Everything good? What's up, y'all? Oh, yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, yeah, man. I'm at work, y'all. See? Yeah, but I'm going to get with y'all. <laughs> your boy been working hard, grinding, you know? I know that's right. Yeah. Yeah, so I don't pull it up on him. This is his first time in my truck. <laughs> you talking yeah. about this thing big. <laughs> yeah, she got a big boy. This uh, thing. Damn. See my TV? My little bed and stuff back there. Yeah, shit, I can't see it. You can turn. Shh. My bad, the water down yeah, there. Yeah, you got all you got. Damn. <laughs> I'm about to, I'm in jail. Damn. Like you in jail. Oh, you yeah, can see that. Yeah, yeah. That's it. Thank you back there. You yeah, that's a bed up there. That's another bit top bed, huh? Uh -huh. Yeah, for another person. Yeah. Uh, so I have made it home. And we got packages. Uno. Dos. Tres. We got packages. We love that. I love to come out to gifts. Gifts to myself. I don't know what this is. This feels fluffy. All right, so let's get ready to open them. Alright y'all, so let's see. Oh, this I got this off AliExpress. This kind of bag. This is a... I got excuse me, that's my grandma. Ooh. This is a Alexander Wayne. Like, um, ooh, I might wear this this weekend. And it like... Oh, we gonna be cute! And then it got Wayne right here. Yes, it's going to fit, so we're going to be cute. Okay. Kobe, what's the matter? What's the matter, baby? I see another dog out there. That's what that is. It's a dog walking by. And my little room that I was gifted is right by the front door, so the front door is open. Now, what is this? Oh, that's a purse I ordered off Ali as well. Trying to stay the hell off Ali. We need to stay off Ali. Child, Ali be getting all my little coins. Oh, she's cute. I believe. Hey. Okay, from the sides. It's pink. A pink little clutch. It got like hearts printed. Leather. Probably pleather. Oh! And then they got the scraps. Let me add. Okay, hold on now. How you add? Oh, I guess I'm supposed to just snap it on. Oh, y'all, child. Okay. And let's snap the other side. I think this price was like $10. Child, I'm stuck on Ali. I'm sorry. Y'all can say what you want. You can say what you want about me. But this is cute. That look a hot mess. This is too freaking cute with the look. Now, this not heavy. This don't really got no weight to it. So, you might want to be careful with this. Because this ain't no heavy chain. This one of those uh, plastic chains. But she is definitely cute. I'll link it. I'm going to leave it in the description box and link it. Um... And then I got this outfit. I ain't even finna take it out. I'll just link it on the side of the screen so you guys can see what it is. But I'm excited to try her on, which I'll probably try her on a little later. So yeah, that's everything. My last vlog, I was supposed to go to um, my storage and put my things up. I think we're going to do that this vlog because the stuff is already in the car. I just didn't feel like driving way up there because my storage is by my old house. Um, so, I think we're going to go ahead and do that while I got my little off day to, you know, get some stuff done. And then I'll probably edit the vlog that I'm going to put up before this vlog. So, 
so I can get that out to y'all so that I could try to like keep the stuff in rotation. So yeah, that's about everything, y'all. I was so happy when I see my daddy. Ah, I felt too good. Like when I first pulled up, um, I popped the brakes and got out the truck, and his coworkers was like, "Oh, you're looking for that guy right there?" They pointed me to um this white guy i guess he's the one that takes the inbound orders for like deliveries and stuff and i was just like oh no i'm looking for my dad so i gave him my dad name or whatever and it was like oh he's right there so that's like that's your that was like, hey that's your daughter and he like yeah that's my baby girl like seeing him so happy like me like representing him making him look good like yeah that's my daughter she drive trucks that's her like it it definitely made me feel good like i ain't even gonna lie i am very proud I'm proud and I know that he's proud because when I pulled off uh, when I was going down the street the street was kind of congested like a lot of people be in the area so it's kind of like a um a body shop so you know whenever it's a body shop you're going to have cars that's you know outside that's probably waiting to be fixed on waiting for a part or something so it's like cars out in the street he was just like you could get by you could get by down there and I'm like yeah daddy I'm gonna drive I could get down so he was like you sure he was like I could go down there and help you guys I was like babe all you got to do is sit here and watch the show like I got this. And then uh, as I was pulling off, he was like, and I was just like, oh, my God. I didn't even know he knew the little symbol to pull the horn. It just was a heartfelt moment that just like, it's a memory that I would never forget. Like, I'm about to tear up just talking about it because knowing like where things were between us and just where it is now. I'm so happy, but it felt so good when i you know when he walked off and he went like this and i blew the horn and i drove off and he watched me you know go down the street and make it out i was just like wow like i i almost cried you know heading back to the terminal to park my truck but yeah that's everything i'm gonna go ahead and probably try some of this stuff on off camera because i did take a shower i took a shower before i left out this morning at the truck stop um so i am clean your girl did take a shower and all i did was deliver that load which was a two hour run so i am clean <laughs> but i'm about to um probably head to my storage and we're gonna go and put some of that stuff up hey y'all so this is the outfit i ended up trying it on and it's super cute it is a wang well it's supposed to be an alexander wang um sweatsuit but this is, of course, a knockoff version. I think I paid $15 for this sweatsuit from AliExpress. And this is the pink bag that I showed you guys that came in the mail also from AliExpress. I think it was $10. Super cute bag. So, yeah, this is how it looks. So I'm, I'm just sitting in the car and I ain't even gonna lie. I'm kind of sad. I um, literally just left the storage, put all, you know, my suitcase and stuff up in there. Oh, um, turn y'all a little bit. <sighs> yeah, but I'm definitely sad. Seeing my stuff in the storage, like, <sighs> I really miss my things. I miss having my own space, having my own place. Like, ugh. I just miss, you know, things that I'm used to. Like, you try not to complain because, you know, you got people that's in a worse situation. And at least for me, it's not like I have to be there. I'm choosing to be there. And, um, yeah, I... <laughs> Oh Lord, I'm trying not to be like a complainer, which I'm not really complaining. It's just a feeling that I'm experiencing right now. Oh Lord, like my clothes, my shoes, my bags. <laughs> my stuff just sitting up in a little space. Oh God, my bed. Oh God, it is definitely a lot. But I just picked up some food from Chipotle. It's a chicken bowl. It's a chicken salad. <laughs> that thing is stuck in my head. They ain't going to tip um, So, yeah, I'm just about to eat this right quick. And um, probably watch a video or two. Um, 
just the I don't know I don't know I <laughs> I'll pick y'all back up when I'm feeling a lot better oh yeah and I got this lemonade I actually like they um natural lemonade so that's what I got to drink but let me just take a minute to you know thank God for what I do have and you know change my energy and then I pick y'all back up hey y'all so today is friday i decided to pick y'all up because i had to run out and finish running my lows for the week however my face would not be making it to the camera because your girl look beat up like <laughs> this week's runs did a number on me and my hair looks horrible i'm definitely gonna be taking it out as soon as i get home um but as you guys can see my truck is filled with water it is about seven cases up here and then we got some gallons of water and then I got like six on my seat behind me so now I have to go get my car bring it to my truck and take all this water out so in trucking for you guys that don't know nothing about trucking uh, I'm sure anybody that's already into trucking you guys already know what this is these are like um damaged goods but they're not really damaged so let's say we deliver something and the pallet like it's broken or you know something is wrong with one thing on that pallet sometimes you know they'll damage out the whole pallet and no you don't have to pay for it or anything the company will pay for it uh, but in this particular case it wasn't my fault or anything like that it had to do with packaging so they ended up letting me get you know all the water for free which I could have got more but I was just like this a little bit too much and I'm a water girl anyways so I got four cases for my dad I got smooth some cases cuz he's gonna come down uh, I'm gonna leave two cases on the truck and then I'll take the rest into um, grandma's house. So yeah, we got us some free water, which should last us for a while. Um, and if I get more, you know, you know, when I get overages and stuff like that, then I, you know, I bring stuff home. But yeah, I'm about to go ahead park and um, well, go get. I'm about to go ahead. So I'm about to go ahead, get my car, and then come back and take all this water out and then fill up my back seat. And then we'll see what happens when we get to the house, if it's some packages or, you know, what it is that we have to get ourselves into. So I had to pick y'all up real quick. I don't remember when I picked y'all up. It's been a minute though. I think it's been about two days. But um, I'm getting ready to go to my aunt's party. It's kind of like a house party, you know. Nothing too major. Not no haul or nothing like that. So I got my hair braided down. I took those plaits out. Got my hair braided down and put on one of my glueless wigs. So this is of course the bang wig. Got on my necklace from AliExpress. Um, Rolex watch. This dress is from the Amazon haul. And then this bag, I got it from Urban Outfitters. And shoes is my Chloe sandals. I don't know why I always do this, y'all. I swear to God, I, I always forget. It's like mirrors galore in here. But yeah, so this is my outfit. I already told y'all the details, so I'm just going to you know, run the camera by so you guys can get a look at the fit bag shoes and that's how we go so i'm about to go ahead and finish getting ready um i'm on facetime with smooth so i'm gonna finish talking to him because i know once i get to my aunt's house i'm gonna be talking to family it's probably gonna be loud music i'm really not gonna be able to speak to him or anything like that and i didn't charge my airpods so i'll see you guys when i get there i'll probably get some b-rolls or something like that or you know you never know but See y'all when we get over there. Hey y'all, so it is the next day. It is Sunday, December 11th. I ain't even vlog last night. It was so last minute, cameras wasn't charged. Like, I literally wasn't prepared. Um, It was last minute that they planned this for my auntie, but I really, really, really wanted to go. Even though I was definitely tired. I was sipping so much Red Bull, Lord Jesus. Thankfully, nothing went wrong. But last night was a nice vibe. My grandma had fun. She been sleeping all day. Like, she had a lot of fun. <laughs> she must got a hangover or something. Because she woke up, used the bathroom, ate something, went back to sleep. 
so I guess she enjoyed herself um but yeah it is now 11 o'clock in the morning and um I did my makeup and stuff all over again so I don't want y'all to think I stuff in my makeup because we don't do that y'all mm -mm, we don't do that but um I just did my makeup I'm about to go take some pictures so I'm about to have my flat iron on right now and I'm about to bump this bang and stuff and get it prepared to go take some pictures um, while I was in here finishing up my makeup FedEx knocked on the door and I was surprised because um I didn't know they ran on Sundays and the delivery tracking said that this package is going to be delivered tomorrow so we got a big box we got a big box and we about to open it together because yeah why not why not open it together so i know what it is i'm just gonna show y'all what it is Holiday, um, holiday hours because I didn't know FedEx deliver on Sundays. a big old box. She got a fat and I want to touch it. We got a lens. I want to touch it. We got a, we got a, and I got a lens. I want to touch it. She got a lens and I want to touch it. Christmas was a new camera. So we got camera, lens, battery with charger, camera scrap, and it came with a free camera case. So this is a whole sling backpack case for the camera. And I ordered it directly from Canon.com. 
which I do not recommend because it took about three to four days before they even shipped it but it did come fast because I ordered it last Monday it shipped out Thursday and it got here Sunday so not bad considering it's the holidays and they didn't promise me you know no specific time or nothing so I guess we're not gonna complain about that but y'all this camera it does it's a EOS M50 Mark II period y'all I really bought this um, for sit down videos because the Sony ZV-1 that I'm recording on now that I vlog on, it heats up a lot when you're doing um, sit down videos. So the M50, I remember I had this camera. This was the first camera that I was vlogging on, but I had the M50, the regular one. This is the Mark II, which is the newer version. Um, I gave my camera to Smooth, so Smooth has the regular version and then I have the newer one. Um, so yeah. I actually got this camera because I noticed that this camera takes good pictures and I want to prefer perfect my Instagram pictures like I want my pictures to look professional so um that's really the main reason why I got this camera for sit down videos and for Instagram pictures because I want to clean up my profile and stuff like that and uh, I think Chelsea Janae takes her pictures on this camera um I think Breland does too. Uh, I was actually watching Jalen, Jalen Day. She recently got this camera too and her friend had been using the camera to take pictures and um, stuff like that. So I'm probably going to watch a few videos and um, we're going to put the settings and stuff on it. But it is brand spanking new. Like Chris, you could tell it ain't been dropped. It, it's brand new i mean but i got it from the canon site so duh it ain't like yeah, i got it from a car or nothing like that um so yeah i actually caught the camera on a steel i ain't even gonna lie not even a deal but a steel so this camera the body alone which is just the camera just the body is $5.99 so just this piece alone is $600 of course it comes with the scrap and the charger and stuff because you need your battery and stuff for your camera but that alone just the body is $5.99 which is $600 and um this lens I believe is like $100 by itself also and then I think um this little sling back thing that they gave me for free it's like $40 or something like that so altogether, the camera with the case and stuff, I probably would have paid like eight hundred dollars, and I paid three ninety nine for everything. Now the reason I paid three ninety nine was because the camera is refurbished. Now, um, when it comes to buying cameras, like anything electronics, I'm always skeptical about that because, like, buying from secondhand places like eBay, Macari, and like, um what it's called facebook marketplace and stuff like that people be lying like they'll probably fix the camera to work at the time that you're looking at it checking it out and then once you don't bought this camera and got it in your possession camera don't work no more you know stuff going on it became faulty camera going out you know stuff just things happening that they didn't even tell you what's wrong with the camera um so i don't like to buy you know electronics off sites like that but like I said, this came directly from the Canon site. And I had put in, you know, the camera because I was looking for the camera. I was initially going to get it from Target. But um, as I was looking for the camera, this actually came up as a promotion from Canon. And I was like, what? $3.99? So when I clicked it, it said refurbished. And then I did my research about refurbished cameras. And it was just like, most of the time, it's like the display camera. Or it can be like a camera um, that somebody bought out the store and they returned it like the next day and nothing is wrong with it. But it's open so they can't sell it brand new because it's open. Um, so yeah, that's why I got the camera for $3.99. And the camera, it ain't got no scratches. It look brand spanking new. Like this probably was a display. Like it's not a scratch. Like nothing. This camera looks brand spanking new brand new nothing is wrong with the camera like we love that i told y'all i'm always listening i'll be trying to save my money because it's a lot going on and 
I barely could afford to be here. It's, it's just too expensive. So to get a camera lens and a travel case bag and all this stuff for $400. Yeah, I was like, let me get that. And this was the last one. So I thought what mine just said sold out. So if you guys are interested in like cameras, um, check Canon and stuff, like whatever camera that you like, because not everybody like Canon. If you like Nikon, you know, if you like Sony, you know, check the websites and see if they have them because they are always back. This camera automatically comes with a one year warranty, but I'm going to add the four year warranty, which they told me I, I have 60 days to add it on to the camera. Um, so I'm going to add the four year warranty because they have a four year warranty for $120. So if I drop my camera, if it's anything goes wrong with this camera within four years, then, you know, I have it under warranty. If they can't fix the camera, then they'll have to replace it for, you know, I guess like the next thing that is identical to this. So still a steal because if I would have paid $800 for a camera and then still had to put the insurance on there. That's almost a thousand dollars right there, and I only paid four hundred dollars. So that was my Christmas gift to myself. I really didn't want that for Christmas. Like smooth asked me what I wanted, I told him no. Like my whole focus is on this house stuff, so I'm really like, I'm really trying to watch my spending and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm excited for my camera. I'm gonna get in here and watch some YouTube videos to try to play with the settings and stuff because my issue with the camera when I had it, which made me not want the camera, was because I didn't know how to set up the autofocus, which is why sometimes I was doing my videos and that's like a year or two ago when I first got on here and some people were saying the whole video was blurry. I didn't even know I filmed the whole video. Video was blurry, wasn't autofocus and nothing was clear. And I began to dislike the camera, but um once smooth got it and he was just like oh you just didn't do this so you didn't do that or you didn't set up the right settings i was just like forget it i was already over it and then i had already bought the sony zv1 so i'll have both cameras because they both serve for different purposes so yeah i'll be vlogging on the zv1 i'll do my sit down videos and my pictures on my um canon but the canon i have to go and buy the flash for the top because um, like i said i was watching Jalen's on and Jalen recommended um, adding a flash for better quality of your pictures so i'm gonna add a flash i already have a clicker because i do take my own pictures and stuff um so i got a clicker i just need the flash and i think that's everything for us to get started with our new baby so yeah that's all we got going off and i go ahead and finish getting ready press this little hair out take my pictures and then i'm gonna get ready to head out for work because my load is picking up early it's picking up at two o'clock tonight so that means i'm gonna try to get me some rest because i have to pull out early so nine times out of ten i'm probably gonna end the vlog right here and start a new vlog because yeah i'm probably that's probably what i'm gonna do i'm probably gonna end the vlog but if not i'll pick y'all back up and let y'all know what's going on so don't forget to like comment and subscribe to your girl channel Leave a comment in the comment section. Turn the post for the page bell so you're notified every single time I drop a video. And please, pretty, pretty, please give the video a big old thumbs up. So before I end this video, I wanted to go ahead and do the giveaway. Today is December 19th. Um, as you guys can see, it is December. Can you see that? Is it closing on? It's December 19th and it's 12, 18 in the afternoon. Um, the giveaway ended on December 17th, which was the last day for you guys to enter. It is my 60K followers giveaway. So the rules were that you had to be following me and Smooth's YouTube channels. And you had to be following both of our Instagram pages. Um, and two people did not um, follow the rules. So you guys were excluded from this giveaway. And... Um, yeah, so I wanted to be fair. Um, so what I did was the first person, Kaiserman Kai 2283. I don't know if you gave me the wrong Instagram name, but your profile was not coming up at all for me to verify your entry um, into the giveaway. So therefore, you were excluded. Uh, and the second person was It's Adela Gus. It's Adela Gus. Um, you're not following the Instagram. So that's why you were also excluded from the giveaway. Um, and that's just me being fair. You know, I want it to be fair to everybody because it's not fair that, you know, people follow the rules and 
two people did it. Um, and I also wanted proof that way you guys don't say, yes, I did, you know, and then you guys show me after the fact. And I know that I saw that you guys didn't follow. So I screenshotted it just to have proof. Um, so let me just tell you guys all the names that I have that are entered into the giveaway. So I have Snugs79, Miss Shay Shay D, LaShawn underscore 36, Passion Love 88, Car 88, Pretty Girl 2525, Miss Thick and Classy, Miss Morgan Ashley, I am Tiffany Barnes, The Real Queen Tyler, My Asia Carter, and Sierra Chantel. So if you guys have noticed on Instagram, I did follow everybody back that followed me. Um, so I did check and that was my way of checking because I went on everybody's Instagram and I followed you guys back. So um, the first giveaway is this Galaxy tablet. Super cute. Brand spanking new. So that's the first giveaway. And then the second giveaway will be the, um, the laptop. It's the laptop computer. So I downloaded this app because y'all know I want to be fair. Initially, I was going to write down names and then have Smooth pull out the names, but I didn't want anybody to think that I was cheating or anything like that. So I actually have this spin app that I'm going to use. And then we're going to do the giveaway together. So like I said, let me just call out the names again so you guys know everybody that's entered in. Um, which is Snug79, Miss Shay Shay D, LaShawn36, well, LaShawn underscore 36, Passion underscore Love underscore 88, Car 88, Pretty Girl underscore 2525, Miss underscore Thick underscore and underscore Classy, Miss Morgan Ashley, I am Tiffany Barnes, The Real Queen Tyler, Myasia underscore Carter, and Sierra Chantel. So all of the names are in this wheel right here. And then we're about to get started with the first winner. All right, so let me put it up on the screen so you guys can see together. So we're going to see who is the first winner. Let's press the spin button. Okay, the first winner is Sierra Chantel. So congratulations, Sierra. You won the Galaxy tablet. Congrats, boo. Let me screenshot this. So I screenshot it, and then I'm going to go ahead and remove her name from the wheel. That way she doesn't get picked again. Let me just verify that she's gone. Okay, so they removed her. So now let's go ahead for our next winner, which will be for the um, laptop. So, okay, my Asia Carter. So, congratulations to my Asia Carter. Yay, you are my second winner for my giveaway. Thank you guys so much for everybody that participated in this giveaway. I will definitely be doing more giveaways. We are at 63K right now. I think I'm going to do my next giveaway at 80. And then, a final, then another giveaway will be at 100K when I receive my plaque. So, um, like I said, thank you guys for coming and interacting. Because most of you guys that enter, you guys have been watching my videos and stuff like that. And you guys are definitely subscribed to the channel uh, for the two winners that were called out, which let me just verify them again. Um, one second. So the first winner, oh, let me go to my photos. Okay. So the first winner was Sierra Chantel. And my second winner is my Asia Carter. So both of you guys can DM me on Instagram um, and let me know where to send your gifts. And of course, I'm going to get the messages because I followed everybody back that did enter the giveaway. So therefore, your message will not go to like those um, um, filter messages for people you're not following. So I will get the um, information as soon as you guys send it to me. Um, keep in mind, it's the holidays. I'm going back on the road today. Well, actually tomorrow morning, which is Tuesday, uh, December 20th. So I won't be back um, home until Christmas Eve, probably. 
and then post office and stuff gonna be a little crazy gonna be closed so you guys may not get the packages until maybe the week of new year's or maybe after new year's um but i will let you guys know when i ship them out i actually put it in a blog that way you guys will know uh, when it's shipped out and then i'll probably send you guys a confirmation with um tracking them and everything to your instagram and stuff like that to keep you guys um updated on um shipping information for your packages but thank you all again for um entering the giveaway um and subscribing to my channel make sure you guys are following the rules i'm definitely sorry to the two people that were not eligible to be added to this giveaway um but hopefully next time you guys will follow the rules and um yeah you guys see i'm very fair i wanted to make sure that everything was done in all honesty and in all fairness which is why you know i put the proof of people that didn't follow um everybody that was entered and doing the drawing you know with an app that way it's not no such thing as i cheated or pulled out a specific name or anything like that so again thank you guys and um don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to your girl channel and i'll see y'all on my next giveaway well my next video <laughs> bye